joined here with Becca from the SPCA and we have two beautiful cats. The one I'm holding right here is Grayson and the one Becca has is Missy and they came as a kind of like a duo. Um, they aren't from the same litter, but they did come from the same home. Yes. Um, <laughs> why were they brought to the SPCA? Um, they just couldn't be in the home anymore. I think they had to uh, go into a home. So unfortunately they did have to come to us. Um, <laughs> Missy is a little bit nervous today. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so they, they, we are trying to adopt them out as a bonded pair. Uh, just because they only really seem to know each other mm -hmm. in an apartment kind of sized place. Um, so initially, even when they first came to the SPCA, they were a little bit afraid. Mm -hmm. And, uh, <laughs> goodness, sorry. And uh, yeah, so I mean, like I said, normally Missy is not like this. <laughs> she is just a little bit scared right now. So <laughs> we are. I'm just trying to make her a little more comfortable. Yeah. But yes, we are just trying to find them homes together and uh, hopefully they can be the most comfortable when they do go yeah. when be, uh, being together. And so how are they, obviously this isn't a good portrayal of how they normally yeah. are. How, <laughs> how normally do they behave or how are they together? Yeah, they're very <laughs> lounge type cats. They like to have just a, you know, a sunbeam to lay in or just a couch to cuddle up on. Um, you know, they, like I said, they are, they're very much just, I just want to lay around and <laughs> eat some food and uh, just kind of hang out. I mean, obviously they, they need a little bit of a diet here, but yeah. Uh, but yeah, they are very, they may be big, but they really don't take up too much space and they're quite quiet. And, um, you know, you said that they're a bonded pair. Why is that kind of important for them to stick together? Um, we're doing that for them. Like, normally we aren't, don't really have much of an issue separating them. Yeah. But, uh, you know, just because they seem they are most comfortable when they are together. Mm -hmm. uh, when they are separated, they are seem to be a bit stressed out. And, <laughs> and uh, yeah, so that's kind of why we want to go that route with them. Um, just, just so they are, like I said, just the most comfortable mm -hmm. that they can be in their new home environment. And have you noticed anything of how they are with other cats or even other dogs? Um, I noticed today that she was a little bit hissy with her next door condo mm -hmm. neighbor, but uh, for the most part, I mean, I think she just likes to lay on her shelf and then uh, do her do her own thing. So I mean. We, like I said, like I think they're just really used to <laughs> each other. <laughs> and then uh, not obviously not the cameras. They're not yeah, <laughs> fans not of the though. camera, but um, oh goodness. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I mean, like they were, they're used to an apartment. So if they go back to an apartment, we're fine with that as well. Or if they go to a nice big house too, I'm sure they'll love that as well too. And how are you doing number wise um, for other cats or even the dogs? Um, our dogs are right around the same. We did have uh, one or two adoptions last week, so that was nice as well. But you know, we keep getting a couple in here and there. Our cats are still quite high. We got lots of kittens uh, mm -hmm. this past week. We just had nine adoptions all together. And, uh, but yeah, so lots and lots of kittens. We just sent, uh, I think, five sets or five kittens today and then three adults. And so, yeah, we're just, we're getting a bunch in and, <laughs> and you know, hoping to find them homes pretty quick. Wow. That, and is there anything um, kind of important coming up for you guys? Not too much. I mean, we, we always got a few things in the works here. So uh, hopefully, hopefully next week we can announce a few more things. <laughs> well, awesome. Well, thank you so much for coming in yes. and <laughs> bringing these rambunctious yeah. little cats. I'm sure um, they'll, event, they'll find a yeah. home that's perfectly suited for them. Yeah, and, and yeah, and they are the, so they're like a two for one too. So they're yeah. to, uh, for an adult adoption, it's 130. So it's 130 for just both. Oh, perfect. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> yes, thanks for having us. <laughs> Pet Project is brought to you by Quick Pick Waste Disposal, Lugminster's number one waste and recycling hauler. Quick Pick is waste collection you can depend on.